Oh, that's better. Oh, th there you are, my word. Well, what's the crack with yourselves? Anything strange or startling? Eh? Didn't we, Squirts? Better get something, hold on. Didn't forget about you, didn't forget about you. Oh, there's Ruby. Some. Cute puppers. Hmm? Cute puppers? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah, but it's very windy and rainy here. Oh, Maya, Buenos Aires, Maya. Good evening, Maya. Good to see you in. Ah, doggos, Maya. Doggos. And there's Himawari. What about you, Himawari? Good evening, good evening. Did hello there work? Did it? Did the hello there work? And there's Corpse. You big weirdo. What about you, Corpse? Good evening. Good evening. Nice one. Good to see you all in. Yeah, I uh, went back to uh, cosplay. Do you mind? I was practicing some some mad balls in a uh, in monster clay. Yeah, that's what you call it, monster clay. And then I moved back there. Was it last night? I, I did a wee bit of messing around with uh, cosplay. So this is cosplay, and yeah, it was much more familiar to get back to it. So uh, what it did was started the usual with a tin foil ball. I'll put this game away. But yeah, start with a tinfoil ball and then give it a coating of some masking tape. And then that just means if I do want to peel peel it back off again, it makes it much easier. You know, instead it bonds really well to the tinfoil. And if you if you were to cover that in tinfoil and then try to peel it off, the tinfoil would hold on to a lot of it. But the the paper masking tape doesn't. So uh I think what I'll maybe try is cover, cover it all, and then cover the front half with an extra layer, and then it means when I'm holding on to the back, it doesn't matter that I smoosh, you, you know, smoosh it up. That's the only, the only drawback with cosplay. But we'll see how we go. And oh, get my references up. Let me see. Where is it? Right there. Right up here. Oh yeah, some, some old school mad balls and some of the newer designs as well. Corpse, I've ever tried duct tape to cover my balls. <laughs> I've, corpse, never. N I've never tried duct tape, no. No. Just the paper. I um, I don't know how duct tape would fur in the oven. Um, I think the, the glue would maybe. You know, uh, duct tape's pretty heavy on the glue. Cheers, cheers. Oh. Very thirsty tonight. So, get these bad boys out of the way. Well, well, Corpse, I suppose that does depend on whether you are going to cook your balls or not. That is true. Yeah. <laughs> That's very true, Corpse. So, prep a wee bit more clay. Ooh, and I'm going to try, right? I've seen a few people when they're, when they're making spheres. I think the first place I've seen it was Mythbusters when they were doing the... The shiny balls of poop. Anybody, anybody remember that episode? But uh, yeah, he was using something like this to help keep the the spherical shape. So I'm gonna try that. I'll try that. But it didn't do too badly with this one. To, as far as keep it in the round profile, that's the one sort of rule when it comes to mad balls. <laughs> you can sort of see from this guy, it it always stays within that circle. You don't really go outside that circle profile. You know, it's very tempting to add a jawbone sort of thing, and but no, no, gotta stay true to the mad ball design. Oh, and if you do want any references, there's a few videos on YouTube. There's not very many, but there's one in particular. Oh, blocker, will do. We'll do blocker. Be safe, dude. Per and Princess Porter's good evening. Gonna collect the PC tomorrow. Nice one. The SSD was screwed up. Oh, I seen your post on Discord. Yeah, yeah. And you're able to get all of it off and replace it. Oh, nice. Nice, Princess. Happy days. Uh, uh, I'm sure you're glad it's sorted, Princess. I'm sure you're glad it, it, there'll be nothing worse. Yeah, I know. Where are we? Yes. 
So as far as yeah, a Madball reference goes, I found this guy on YouTube, a Slime House, and he's actually got a wee mini documentary. And let's see, wow, well, playlists would it be in there maybe. I want some... But yeah, real, real good channel. Really good channel. Oh, oh, sorry, better mute that. <laughs> Where is the Mad Ball episode? Oh, there it is. So yeah, he's got some real good footage, 360 footage of all of them. You know what I mean? They're slightly older designs, which is cool anyway. You want the old designs. Well, I do anyway. Uh, yeah, I know. So yeah, really helpful video as far as references go. All the, you know, all the newer, she was all the newer designs, some of the older ones. You know, I know. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, Princess, nice one. Ah, oh, Tonic. Good evening, Tonic. Good to see you in. Ooh, Corpse, thinking about it. Thinking about a Corpse. Yeah. Yeah. But yep, that's Slime House. Let me see, I'll get you the, the link. There we go. Ooh, I wonder could you use this for chewing up the... Uh, uh, well, nah, maybe not. Oh, sorry, change screens. <laughs> okay. Cool. So you may as well prep this wee bit. Have it all sitting in strips. Oh, but it's been great. I was saying to Mel uh, today, I feel like I've done more sculpting in the past month with the monster clay than it would do in six months with the, with the cosplay. Just having a big part of it there and a load of it to mess around with. That's just really cool. Oh, Ezra, um, oh, what about you, dude? Good evening. Good evening. Good to see you in. Oh, Blacker's back. Oh, dude, that was quick. That was a quick eight mile. My word. Corpse. Oh, sorry, Corpse. <laughs> sorry, Corpse. Ezra, um, what? That's a very cool yake indeed. I thought that I was gonna say, is that a yake in 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 the emotes there? Meg Meg of one. Hmm. Okay, it's gonna be a little while. Oh, we don't know our wee package. Oh nice, nice dude. But yes, certainly some difference going from monster clay back to cosplay. Just to get that smooshiness back is oh man, that's some difference. It really is. The uh, just feel like you have more freedom with it. I just have no idea. Very cool though. Very cool. Oh, a fake like oil for your aunt. Oh, nice dude. Nice. Ooh, uh, uh, is there any plans, dude, to maybe glue it and put it in the garden? That was the first thing I would think of for a fake Lego oil. Get it all glued together and get that bad boy in the garden. I don't know. Uh, I, yeah, it's wrong. Yockeys are very cool. I'm a big fan of yockeys, dude. I, may, I remember making a yockey bot for Mazart, a tattoo artist. One of the first commissions I did, it was a Yake bot. Oh, Corpse Pasta Maker's right here. See, attached to this block. Yeah, I, but I need to soften it up first. You don't want to be, you don't want to, eh. Uh, sitting there, sitting right there. <laughs> but yeah, I don't want to put it under too much stress, so uh, uh, I soften it up a wee bit for it first. No, oh, no. Oh, Krampus in the background there. Yeah. I have to get a good picture of his head and get him in an emote. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ooh, it's running nice and other. Nice, dude. Nice. 8.50. Let's go. <laughs> Ooh. 
Be it 51 card. <laughs> I block her. <laughs> you see, I Blocker doesn't mind outbidding himself, but it's a, if it's other people, get out of here, corpse. I don't know. A blocker's the only one allowed to outbid himself. <laughs> <laughs> 900 and a can Ooh, and a can of Aussie piss juice <laughs> Nice, nice Sweeten the deal, sweeten the deal <laughs> Blocker side, blocker side <laughs> And uh, Blocker, is that going to be paid in installments? Interest free? Interest free installments? I believe it wants to. I know you could have just went 9 901. 901 and 2 cans. <laughs> just for 3. Okay, Corpse, thanks for keeping me right on that. Thanks for keeping me right. No, no, no. Isram, still on coffee? I know, Isram, it would be the crack of morning. The crack of morning over there, dude. Yeah. Apologies, Isram, get that coffee in you. Get that coffee in you. Welcome to and Andy Macca AM. Yeah, dude. Half past 11 in the morning? Is it even daylight at that time? <laughs> Is the sun even up? <laughs> Crack him up, man. It's not me, I don't know. Let me go back, go back for an hour. That's what I do. <laughs> Head back for an hour. <laughs> eh, poppers? Nah. These ones wouldn't lap, man. Sure, these wouldn't. No. Mm-hmm. That's it, one. That's it. But yeah, I mean, the difference. I knocked this guy up last night in about an hour. That was just a... Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. So, some difference to the uh, monster clay as far as speed goes. I want to open the curtains. I know. <laughs> Ezra, maybe in the height of summer? Maybe? In the height of summer? Or no? Is that a big no-no? Even, even more so? <laughs> there we go. Yep, eat same carrots. That's it, dude. Even worse, I uh, keep the heat out. Ah, uh, no, I know, dude. I thought about that as soon as I said it. We we'll keep the heat out and keep it nice and cool. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know. Although, as Roma, do think. Uh, do you ever do you ever watch what we do in the shadows? <laughs> that's yeah. That's what springs to mind straight away. <laughs> Oh, that's it, cold and dark. Yeah. Oh, I blocker it is. It's pushing it here as well. Yeah. Yeah. I oh, believe. <laughs> well, you know, it's a more figure of speech, Ezra. Yeah, it's more of a figure of speech. I get you. Oh, blocker, yeah. Yeah. We had a bit of frost last night as well. Just cranking them out here. Cranking it out. Summer, dude. We were saying about that today. Summer. I miss sitting with the back door open in our new house. You know what I mean? Isn't that right, pups? Sitting with the back door open, man. Pops just coming in and out as a please. 
Great. Let's get these balls covered. Easy now. Haddonfield 79. What about you, Haddonfield? I'm awesome, thanks. I'm awesome. How's yourself? Oh, Blocker, you, uh, it was foil first, and then I covered it in masking tape. Yeah, so foil first, and then covered the foil in masking tape. And that means, dude, right, if I ever mess up or, or it goes any direction that I don't like, it's very easy to peel off. Yeah, yeah, very easy to peel off. So, eh. Uh, that's my sort of my, my sort of way of being a wee bit more precious with the cosplay. Yeah, I know. Seriously, man, you'd rather have a cold and rainy? Yeah, see, I, I don't mind the cold so much. It's the rain, you know, getting soaked when you're walking the dogs isn't nice. Like, but when it's cold, it's nice because then there's not my, many pe many people about. You know. <laughs> and Harden, all good. How's the progress in Madballs? Oh, you missed the last stream. Well, eh, uh, Harden, the last one. I think I, I finished. Did I, f I finish messing around with this guy? And I didn't take him any further, sort of thing, in the monster clay. And now I've moved back on to uh, to cosplay. And I whipped this guy up last night. He's in cosplay, so uh, that gives you an idea of a sort of direction I'm going. And I'm sort of thinking now, should I pre-sculpt the teeth and bake them and then push them in to give it? It just gives it sort of more of a. It gives it more of a crisp kind of. You know, or or that's why I've kind of got two going here because I'll, I'll I'll try maybe, uh, you know, painting or so painting, cooking the the teeth first first. Here can you talk tonight? I can hear talk, eh? Oh, cheers, Hadden. Oh, I'm the crafting space. What about your crafting space? Good evening. Good evening. What is a crack for yourself? But yeah, I'm definitely on a mad ball kick at the moment. Up and ooh, I got some stickers. I got some mad ball stickers. Who would, would anyone like to see my mad ball stickers? <laughs> You're happy to take cold over rain? Yeah, crafting space. Yeah, in the same, in the same. Okay, Hadden, the crafting monster says you put the whole container in. And what height did you run? Oh, right, Hadden, I'll explain. It. Yep, I'll explain right now. Right, so with the crock pot, right. So this is what Hadden's talking about, my crock pot. Yeah, so uh, as you can sort of see Hadden, it, the, there's, there's a big ball of it there. I, w I wouldn't put it all in at once, put it like that. What what, what I what I did was, first I, I put the, the container of monster clay, it's in a cupboard there. The container of monster clay in the oven, do you know what I mean? And got it soft, and, they, and filled it about halfway. And then the heat settings on it, see, so can you see that? There's just... Low, high, and warm, yeah. So I sort of looked it up in the instructions, right? And the low setting it goes to about seventy-five degrees C. The warm it goes to about seventy-eight degrees C, or sorry, the the high, and then the warm only goes to about seventy-four. And then it rec it recommends that monster clay doesn't go any higher than about seventy-four. So I just keep it on warm. But what I do, Hadden, is before this, before I start the stream, about an hour before I start the stream, I turn it on and, and leave it on for a full hour, just on warm, and it turns it all the liquid. And then when I start the stream, I turn it off and just sort of simultaneously, if I think it's getting a bit stiff sort of thing, I turn it on for a wee bit. And yeah, yeah. You just don't want it too high, Hadden. You know what I mean? You, you'll see on the on the instructions of the Monster Clay, it gives you the, the, the temperature, you know, the max temperature sort of thing. Yeah, and uh, Blacker knew it was off Amazon. That was only that was only uh, fourteen quid off Amazon. That wee crock pot. It wasn't very expensive at all. No, not mad. I didn't want anything too big. Yeah, I know. And uh, here it was Mel bought it for me. It wasn't it was nothing to do with me. Mel, it was the after the second night. I think it was a streaming with Monster Clay. Mel had uh, heard me sort of run back and forward to the oven a few times and was asking after the stream what I was up to. Yeah, uh, I know, and yep, and ordered one. So, yeah. 
Bye, Lucky. Bye, Lucky. <laughs> Oh, the stickers. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, dude. <laughs> right, stickers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let me see. Hodden. Uh, oh, very welcome. I've read the instructions. Just line it up with the crock pot set. Yeah. I wonder if we could just cut the brick in half and put it in there. You could try, Hodden. You could try. You know. But Hodden, just put your oven on really, really low and leave the door open a crack. Do you know what I mean? And uh, yeah, give it sort of 20 minutes. Just keep an eye on it. Do, uh, um, as long as you keep an eye on it, it'll be fine. You know what I mean? Don't need to be... Yeah, I don't know. Or hadn't heat the top of it with even a heat gun or a hairdryer. Just hit it with that and just scrape it off in, 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 in bits, you know? But right, stickers. So I got the stickers on red bubble. Yeah, yeah. Oh, propane stove, I get you, Hadden. I get you. Yeah, I know. I get you. A hairdryer? A hairdryer, maybe? Her dryer would work like. Right. Yes, Redbubble. Right, Redbubble is like a website that you cannot upload your 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 designs to. And they And then they only get made when they're ordered. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, Robert Davies, that was the artist that I got those these from. Got, got what, one, two, three, four, I think about five of them, five or six maybe. But yeah, any amount. I mean, unreasonably, like a, a reasonably priced. You know what I mean? You can get a wee, wee set together, maybe, uh, you know, six to eight stickers and keep it around a tenner. Do you know what I mean? So I think that's reasonable. At least they're done by, by artists, because there's a load of guys I follow on Instagram that do really cool stickers, but it's getting them over. You know what I mean? You get killed on the postage. So yes, I'll show you, show you what I got now. Yes, Robert Davies. Robert Davies. A decent size, like. Yeah, yeah. And then I've won on, already on the on my locker. <laughs> yeah, I know. Already on my locker. But I've kind of I've uh, made it made a sort of deal with myself that I'm not can't put any more up until uh, I get one finished of my own. Do you know what I mean? And then I can take a picture of it and, and get a sticker made of it. I think that's a, uh, that's that's the, the the plan at the minute. So uh, my own, t you know, I really want to get one of these up. But uh, yeah, yeah. So that that's the sort of deal. I don't know. Oh, Lenny. Oh, what about you, Lenny? Good evening. Good evening. Working and lurking, I'm assuming, Lenny. Hopefully not too hard. Hopefully not too hard. So, yeah. Red bubble. That's where I got those. Very cool. Details brilliant on them, like. Yeah. Oh, let's go, Lenny. Last three days. Oh, it'll fly in, Lenny. It'll fly in. Last three days. Yeah. So you go, Lenny. Lenny's starting a new job in three days. Yeah. Right. Let's see how well this works. Doesn't feel like it's doing anything at the minute, but you never know. Let me try the rough side. Mm. It's certainly showing up the low spots, if anything, that's what it's doing. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
artifacts. It's wrong to be right. Um, not all artifacts are endorsed by Andy. <laughs> yeah, Blocker, yeah, that's why I include that disclaimer now, you know? Yeah. So, not all artifacts are endorsed by Andy. There, is that, that covers me, doesn't it? That covers me. <laughs> The best sex is fun. Let's go. Let's go. There we go. That's I'm happy with that. Yeah, I'm happy with that. And like what we say here, if it ain't fun, it ain't done. I don't know. And yeah, that did, that sort of showed up the low spots. Because yeah, every claw on a cat's paw points the same way to get down and retreat that one's back down. Ah, crafting space. All handy facts are subject to change at any time. <laughs> Love it. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, what about you, Stevie? Good evening. Good evening. What an entrance, dude. <laughs> What's a crack with yourself, Stevie? <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Stevie's a, a, a giant, by the way, in case you didn't know. Stevie is an actual giant. I don't know. For just for a bit of context. <laughs> a Twitch chant. Yeah, a Twitch chant. Oh, no problem at all, Mr. Anne. Good evening. Good to see you in. Good to see you in. And Bug Boy was a bad boy. Good evening, Bug Boy. Good to see you, man. What is the crack with your sales? Oh, Sam. Oh, nice one, dude. See you soon. See you soon. Safe journey. Oh, good point, Bug Boy. Good point. How did the charity stream go? That's not bad. It's not bad. Oh, it's just permanent, dude. Okay. Okay. Oh, you mentioned that before, Ezrom. You had mentioned that before. It was just going to be permanent. Well, no, we're going to need to prep more clay already, am I? Can't see that getting around that whole ball. Let's see. Ooh, brass clay. Ugh. Oh yeah, Mr. Han. <laughs> I'll be taking home a new dog on Saturday. Oh, bug boy. Nice one. Nice one. Is it a puppy or, or a rehome or rescue or... That's exciting, like. Though so some folks are more comfortable than waiting to a cause. So it makes it easy for them. Yeah. Yeah. I hear you, man. Yeah. Boston room shelter. Oh, dude. Yes, bug boy. Nice. Nice. Six year old. Lovely. Lovely, man. Oh, bug boy, please sir. share some pics on the Discord. Oh, yes, Stevie. Back some cosplay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I was saying from all the all the mad ball sculpting I was doing with the monster clay over the weekend sort of thing, I knocked this guy up in like an hour last night with cos clay. So much quicker the progress, like. So yeah, yeah, back to old faithful. And yeah, takes a wee bit of needing, Dantha, yeah. Wee bit of needing. And I've got a passing machine here as well, so when it gets soft enough to get into that, I'll put it through that. 
Makes it a bit quicker, doesn't it? Uh, why do you have to crumble it first? Why not just use a bigger cut off the block? Oh, because it's very crumbly. It's very crumbly. You know, so uh, uh, if, it, if it was taking a big, say, it'd just break a big bit off the block like that. You know, I would, it would I would just crumble it all and break it up into wee bits. So I just slice it like that first and it makes it quicker. Do you know what I mean? Just, it feels more efficient. Yeah, feels a bit more efficient. You know, you can see that now. It's been through the pasta machine, but it's still really crumbly. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. So it's just like quicker to chop it up a bit first. Yeah, I know. It could say smooshy a bit quicker. Uh, pretty much even fighting with it. I don't know. But yeah, still. Very crumbly. Looks so nice and soft. Yeah, but it's very cr crumbly. At first, at first it is, what do you see? So like you see, those bits have been through the, through the, uh, the pasta machine w just once. So put this piece through just once. And like I was showing you, still very crumbly. Still, and it's still quite tough. Oh no. Goes past it down the road. <laughs> Accidentally eat it over forbidden pasta. Funny Diantha, that's why I didn't buy the, the chocolate coloured monster clay. <laughs> Looks a lot like chocolate. <laughs> They're much smoother already. Yeah, forbidden pasta. Right, this should be the last time, and then it'll be nice and smooth. When I did Star Wars dinner for Christmas, used food day and stuff, so I also had pasta this sort of grey colour, did you? Seriously? Oh, I just used cold clay then, I. <laughs> Although that would be expensive, wouldn't it? That would be an expensive pasta. You would be safe for just using regular pa or regular pasta, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> One avocado naki that was really slimy. The recipe, oh, what's this slime pods? It's like a cookbook from Disney. That's wild, that's brilliant, though. That's really cool. So we just see the beginning so far we've seen more of the end. Oh seriously? Oh nice one. Yeah, the beginning. Um it it looks like a turd until it doesn't. You know, I know. Yeah. Oh, wait inside. That is just a tinfoil ball covered in masking tape. That's all that is. Just a tinfoil ball covered in masking tape. Yeah, and the reason I've used masking tape, I don't normally cover it in masking tape first, but I've used masking tape this time to, to so that I don't need to worry that if I want to take the clay off, it'll just, it just peels off real easy, you know, whereas tinfoil, it would really grip to the tinfoil. That's, that's my thinking behind that, because I'm very, very precious about my cause clay, <laughs> you know. Yeah, yeah. Like I'm, I'm, I'm tempted to to cut a line around this and see if I can remove the back side of this. Do you know what I mean? Because that's the, the that's the way it would like it to be done. You know, so it leave the back completely with no clay on it at all, and it means it wouldn't be smooshing anything. It would work on the front and then get it baked. Yeah, I know. I may try it. I may try it. We'll see.
Mickey, try a water balloon. Blow it up a bit, then coat it. Maybe a bit soft, but hollow balls. Mmm. Mickey, I did think I cut one of the pup's toys in half. And good evening, Mickey. Yes, good evening. Good to see you in. What do you see? What do you see? Oh, apologies. Uh, eh. A current song has snuck into the 80s playlist. A current song? Gasp. Okay. It is still a nice tune, isn't it, Vic? Just have, have this. But it was a bit big. It was a bit big. Oh, no. I thought what I could do is line that with strips. Oh, no. Just line it. Line the inside of it with strips. And then stuff it, stuff it with tin foil, and then do the same on the other side, and then stick them together like that. But it di didn't really work. It didn't really work. Yeah, no. The the once you started stuffing the tin foil in, it kind of started going like this, kind of. Yeah, no. And then I thought, well, that's silicone, so I wonder would that survive in the oven? Do you know what I mean? So it could build over the over the top of it. Do you know what I mean? Build over the top of it, and then bake it, and then just pop that off. But I thought. Ugh. Uh, the, the likelihood of that melting is pretty high. I don't really want to test it. I'll just make my own balls. Yeah, I know. That's that's what I concluded. I thought it's 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 not that hard to get something pretty round. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that's not hundred percent round, but it's close enough. Yeah, I know. So yeah, I just I had to not stress about it as much. Oh, let's go, Spectre Spectre RTA. What about you, Spectre? Raiders, come on on in. What is the crack? What are we up to tonight? Let's see. Go. Oh, that's not a nice one, dude. Just run off the side. Uh, yeah, up to there. I'll leave. Don't I'll do leave it. Part of it right <laughs> Just as a visual guide. This top one. Oh, nice one. Drop off. a wee follow there. I wasn't following. Shame. Shame. So as long as you've got the actual tape stuck down, this stuff peels off no problem. Oh, good afternoon. Until Didn't I understand. Oh, nice. My dashboard. One piece um, coaster. Oh, nice. Nice one. I had a bunch more Oh, these are a so few coasters here, aren't they? Thank you very much for that, Chelsea. I really do appreciate it. And I'm awesome, thanks. Yeah, I'm awesome. Very much appreciated. I'm doing a wee bit of mod ball sculpting. That's what I'm up to. I want to try and recreate one of my one of my favourite toys. That's what I'm up to. Yes, yeah, a bit of coaster staining as well. M Spectre, do you have a a, a, a Instagram? We'll go get a wee nosey at. Yes, sir. There's a set of avatar coasters. Ooh, you made them a while back. Let's see. Let's see. Very cool. Mmm, Spectre Studios? No, that's not you, no. Oh, there we go, nice one. There's Rom, super modern there, super modern dude. Yes, oh, brilliant, yeah. <laughs> what about that, I know, I know. Ezrom's on it like a car bonnet. First things first, drop a wee follow. Oh, yes. Oh, man. Oh, what? Oh, my nephew would go bananas for those. That's wild. They are lovely, man. Lovely. Oh, flip me. Love it. Oh, oh well, much appreciated. Much appreciated. We'll get a look at your stuff and then I'll show off a few of my things. Oh, and thanks for the follow. Thank you. Lovely, man. You seeing this, Miss Dion? You seeing this? Brilliant.
always was aware of One Piece. Never really watched the, the anime or anything like that. And then the live action came out. Watched the first episode and was like, meh. And then a couple of weeks later, there was nothing on. And I stuck the live action on again and bin binge watched the whole lot. <laughs> it was really good. Ooh, ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Boil and mash them, stick them in a stew. Spuds. Nice. Isn't that wild? Isn't that wild? And was that the case? Watch it, didn't really enjoy it. Like, I didn't even like the characters. They made me, made me go, you know, oh, like, really? Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> you know, it just took a, a wee bit of time. It just took a wee bit of time. <laughs> But I still haven't watched. I still haven't watched the anime. Yeah, I know. Or animation, as you call it, because it was made by Netflix. So you can't really call. Is that correct? You can't really call something made on Netflix an anime. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a doctor. What I know. But yes, this is one of my ugly pumpkins. My own design. Most of the stuff I just make up as I go along. That's usually a starter out with an idea or a picture in my head kind of thing that I would that I, I would like it to look like and just hope that it gets something like that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and then the stone with the airbrush, the painting stone with the airbrush. And just regular paints, no special paint. I'm really surprised at the way this this turned out like pearlescent, but this is just purple and green. There's no the. You know what I mean? There's no, there, there isn't even any blue in there. I, I was surprised, uh, you, you know, when, when it came out like that. It, it really came out cool. And then these are uh, a couple of my bunny characters. Crack bunnies. This guy still needs his UV resin on his eyes. Oh, no. Yes, back there, just acrylic paints. Just acrylic paints through the airbrush. Yeah. Although the brand was a uh, Kratex, the word Kratex. Uh, I was lucky enough to, to, in a competition, I won a few bottles of Kratex spray paint. You know, but there's not, it's not as if they're effect paints or anything. They're just blues, greens, purples, oranges. You know, nothing special at all. It's uh, quite handy when you don't really know what you're doing. You know, when you don't know what you're doing, things turn out pretty cool. <laughs> and this is the Krampus I did over, over Christmas. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Spectre. So, yeah, he was loosely inspired by an Oni. An Oni, and then the, the Krampus from American Dad. That's the, the two inspirations for these guys. So, yeah, an Oni Demon, which I believe are Japanese. And, uh, and yeah, the Krampus from American Dad. <laughs> who, who's, uh, who is a funky Krampus, for sure, funky Krampus. So yeah, right now I'm working on my own design of a mad ball. These guys up here, hopefully, no, not that one. The one I'm working on at the minute is the skeleton. This guy. So this is my inspiration sort of thing. So I wanna, what what I'll do is I I, I sort of be, I'll base the sculpt as closely as I can to that, and then and then sort of go off on my own tangent with it. But I want it to be instantly recognisable as a mad ball. So I have to sort of stick to the rule of staying within the circle. Do you know what I mean? No matter what sort of angle. Where's the other one? You, you know the sort of one rule that they, they stick to is uh, is staying within the circle. And yeah, these are mad balls. Like I said, these are. Uh, the one that I had when I was a child was, oh no, not that one, sorry, was this guy, Slobulus. That was the one I had. And, and uh, yeah, I'll, I'll eventually get to him, but I thought I'll start with the skull one first. And uh, and then maybe go on to the Cyclops one, where's he? Yeah, this guy. Oh, oh. This guy here. Oh, no. So, eh. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm. There would be the th there's a three of them there. Yeah, yeah. 
Stevie, bulbs are ordered. Nice one, dude. Nice one. Oh, and yes, Spectre, if you want to raid and run, go for it there. Fully understand. If you want to go get fed and watered and and uh, get your feet up. Oh, so this is a, a, a wee sort of, I'd call it a test one. It was just like an, I took an hour last night and uh, just kind of roughly put them together. So I'm starting a couple of new ones here now. Just working on getting this a bit more round. Just looking for low spots. Tomorrow, dude, seriously? Even I ordered this late? Ordered 20 past 8? That's wild. 20 past, yeah, 20 past 8. Amazon, dude. Still? No, I, I couldn't order anything off Amazon at this time, dude, to get here tomorrow? No. I would have to order it before uh, 2 o'clock, I think it is. Yeah, I can't. That's the only way I'll get next day on Amazon. But ordered before two o'clock. The hardships, man. The hardships. No, oh, no. That's what happens when you live out here in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Might as well be on the moon, as far as Amazon's concerned. Oh, so it's say, uh, oh right, okay, okay. There you go. Then you might not, you might not get it tomorrow. Then, fingers crossed, fingers crossed, dude. Yeah, and this is definitely helpful. This is helpful. So there you go. If you're if you're struggling uh, making your own balls, get yourself a small uh, scone cutter, a yeah, cookie cutter. Well, this is a scone cutter, I think. <laughs> and as far as I remember, the first time I seen this was on Mythbusters. Adam Savage was doing it with his, his turd when they were trying to polish a turd and he was trying to keep it as round as possible. Grind those balls, corpse. <laughs> you know, normally people pay the big bucks for this sort of viewing. You know, I know, I'm telling you. Normally this is the big bucks. And he has really helped, like, I don't know if you can notice that helping, like. I tell you, you've been invited to collaboration with Team Susandi. Ah, oh, Stevie, nice one, dude. Nice one, collabs are what it's all about, man. Nice one, Stevie. Oh, you'll kill it, man. You'll kill it. Team Susandi, he's mostly airbrushing. Corpse 250, Dane. Not that those ain't ball prices. Those are, those are, those are leg prices, dude. Or foot prices. Those aren't butt prices. No way, 259. Scon as in on or own? <laughs> on as in on. Yeah, scon. Yeah. What do you think I'm from Hillsborough, Mickey? <laughs> I ain't living in Hillsborough. No, no. Fucking scon. <laughs> yeah, are you with me? Are you with, are you with me? <laughs> Stevie, building... Yeah, Mackie, nice one. Hey, building a tornado aircraft, he's going to use it as reference for some artwork. Oh, man. Kick ass, Stevie. Kick ass. Now, just keeping it tidy. Just keeping it tidy here. Honoured, Stevie? That's... Yeah, dude. Yeah. Oh, no. For sure. Although he should feel just as honoured having a twist chant on his stream. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Crafting space, your cup of coffee has a hole in it. Better go make another one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll get a quick toilet break, maybe. Will do. That's good timing as any to get a quick toilet break. 
wonder how his rum's getting on with his mor morning coffees. Here to flip me. No need to thank me, Stevie. No need to thank me. Uh, no, not at all. Thank you. And there will be another one for sure. What about uh, what about a mad ball sculpt along where we're all sculpting mad balls? Oh, that would be great, wouldn't it? Oh, what a dream! <laughs> all sculpting mad balls simultaneously. This town's been kicked out, seriously? Coffee's going good, trying to make PayPal on screen alert. Ooh, bad. Mm. Mm -hmm. You want to make it easier, hi. Yeah. I know, Mickey. Everyone, I know. Imagine. Could you imagine? Ah, there you go, Mr. Ann. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Mr. Ann's in. Mr. Ann is all in. Wonder could we get toilet after dark in on it? Oh no. That's something toilet fans want to see, like toilet after dark on playing on, on stream playing with balls? Come on. <laughs> right. Quick wee break, quick wee break. Spike, you're in charge. I shall be right back. Don't need a drink, do you? No, plenty left. Bit of beat, Stevie. Not at all. Not at all, Stevie. Oh, uh, no. Ooh, maybe some, some just for men, maybe. Some just for men instead. <laughs> Stevie, I don't know. I don't know. Only speaking from experience, sick. <laughs> Ooh, Mr. Ann, we coffee with Bailey's. Nice. Nice. Alrighty. Back in two. Back in two. Oh. Oh. What? Oh, Stevie. What happened? What happened, Stevie? Stevie going in slow motion. Oh, nice one. Nice one. And refresh. There we go. Yeah. Time that is wrong to maybe go back to the old clippy to see if it's working any better. Well, yeah, I know. What do you think? What do you think? We have several. Oh yes, Stevie. I Ezra's talking about Cl yeah. Clippy is referring to what plays videos. It is crap, absolute junk. Oh, Blade City one. What about Blade City one? Good evening. I don't have to crank princery, but oh, right. So that's my two balls done. What I'm gonna do now is section them out. You yeah, know, get my my la halfway lines on them, and then cover one half with another layer and and that's the that means it can comfortably hold the back of it yeah yeah i know knowing that i've added more clay well after it's baked kind of thing that's the plan anyway hopefully it works out prep a wee bit more clay first is there a me oh yeah 100 percent realistic 100 percent realistic yeah oh yeah oh no <laughs> Uh, <laughs> anything, uh, anything you're sculpting, it's never, never symmetrical. Never, n don't you know? Don't go for symmetry. To say, dude, yeah, <laughs> that's right, that's right. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Well, you gotta sculpt what you know, Mickey. You know, you gotta sculpt what you know. <laughs> oh yes, what I wanted to try was taking half of this guy's head off to see. If how well the the masking tape worked. Yeah, you know, I know. So yeah, I'll try that. To just peel off nicely, I would think. Alright. Let's get it started. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that.
Ooh, Spectre. Uh, sculpting for about 9 or 10 years. 9 or 10 years, I would say. And before that, uh, I, I enjoyed uh, Whitlin. Yeah, Whitlin was my jam. Have you had an old lady with no handle? An old lady with no... Oh, ladle? An old ladle, sorry. An old ladle with no handle. I, uh, yeah, I get you, dude. I get you. Oh yeah, the tinfoil, the tinfoil would bite on it real, you know, really. No, it's coming off the sort of the way I expected. You yeah, know, the way I expected. You know, you know, the tinfoil would really bite it, like. Yeah, Spectre, yeah. Quite a while, all right. Quite a while. And I've only recently started sort of practicing uh, anatomy or realistic things, if you know what I mean. I was uh, always into sort of making my own characters up and stuff. Yeah, uh, I know. Since about 7 a.m. <laughs> yeah, that worked well. That means now, you know, I, I could bake that, you know, if it was detailed enough, but it's not. It's not. But yeah, that means I, I could bake that if I wanted to and know that, you know, I'm adding more clay to the back of it. But what I'll stick to what I said with these guys and add another layer on the front. You sit there. Oh, good clay under nail. Nothing worse. Nothing worse. Oh. Well, there is worse things, but you know, you know what I mean. <laughs> Mickey, a wee bit, yeah, a wee bit, Mickey. Well, that, that one looks a wee bit like the minute because the detail's just not, uh, you know, it's not not finished kind of thing. But yeah, that's kind of a vibe that I want that sort of vibe as well. Day of the Dead sort of vibe. Yeah. Shouldn't have to prep any more after this. This should be the last for the night anyway. Plenty here now. Uh, Spectre, yeah, it just helps kind of soften it up. Do you know what I mean? If you look at this, this has already been pre-softened. See the way it's nice and pliable and sort of, you know, I've, I've, I've already softened that up, put it through the pasta machine a few times and, and, and it, it conditioned it kind of thing. But when it's fresh off the block like that, as you see, it's very crumbly. So what it could do is just like straight from the block, just sort of break it off like that there into, into smaller and smaller bits and it would just keep crumbling. So we just find it easier just to chunk it up first in, in, in bits like that. Yeah, I know. You'll see straight away that uh, after it's been through the, the past machine a couple of times, it just completely changes. Yeah, I know. But yeah, to the point where I've seen people actually complaining where, where they've, you know, they've started with the cosplay and, 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 you know, broke it up the way I have and kind of went, oh no, this is just crumbly. It must be old. But it does take you to not warm it up or anything, but it is conditioning it because it's not as if that'll go back to that state anytime soon. You know what I mean? It's not as if when it cools down, it'll go back to its original state. It just, I don't know, it's hard to explain. It's nothing to do with heat, it's just more to do with uh, getting it moving, you know, I know. But even now, like, this is still really crumbly. But what do you see? And then I stick it stay through my pasta maker there. Still, still quite crumbly. Crumbly, it's not really elastic yet. Mickey, activating the plasticizer. Okay, nice one. There we go, Mickey. Activating the plasticizer. It's fast me to see the tools and processes. Oh, there are so oh, yeah, me too. Me too. Yeah. Well, this is just an old pasta machine that I picked up out of a charity shop. Oh no. Nosey Bewitch? What about you, Bewitch? Oh yes, Eraser. Oh yes. I didn't see you coming in there, Bewitch. You snuck in. You snuck in on me. Oh. So there we go. There's the. Hey, did. You snuck in. Alright. But welcome. Come on, come on, on in. Sneaky or not. 
But yeah, you can see already, much better. Much better. Coming awake. Nice one. Nice one. So you're still you're still tiptoeing around then. <laughs> Like you can imagine how much clay you would need to make it solid if I wasn't doing it with the foil and the the tape. Right, so that means now that that I've done that, I, I know that when I sculpt everything on the front here and I get I'm happy with it. I can bake it and not worry that that uh, I have haven't got enough clay on the back kind of thing because I haven't added any clay on the back yet. Does that make sense? <laughs> a bit like this. But if it was to bake this now, I know I'm safe because I haven't got any clay at all on the back. It's sort of the same thing. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, baking them, Spectre, uh, what I do is I put them in the oven cold and then I turn the oven up to 100 degrees, 100, 120 max, and then leave them on for half an hour at that temperature. And then after half an hour, turn the oven off and leave them in there for another half hour with the oven off, low and slow. That's the way I, uh, I would describe it. Low and slow. The instructions... I don't know, instructions, oh, there's a wee bugger. <laughs> 135 for half an hour. Yeah, I know. So, yeah, I go low and slow. And then, like I was saying, um, Spectre, so I could bake this, do you know what I mean? I could bake this as it is, and then after it's baked, I can come back and add more clay over the top and bake it again. And add, you know what I mean? So, as long as you don't paint it, like what do you see, like this guy? So, this guy's been sitting in this state for months, you know? But if I wanted to, because he's not painted, I could come back and, and add more clay on them, you know? And I just haven't painted him because I know it'll be a bollocks to paint. <laughs> you know? Yeah. It would definitely was a commission or something, but that was just for myself, sort of thing. Oh uh, no, but yeah, yeah. Uh, unpainted, unfinished, 15,000. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's my 10 eyed beholder, wasn't it? 10? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh yeah, yeah, I got the whole 10. I wouldn't be beaten. The original, the original beholder had 10, so I had that. Well, it's 11, including his own. Like. It does, Spectre, yeah. Begging it hardens. Hardens it indefinitely, Spectre. Hardens it indefinitely. When we say hardens, it does keep its flexibility, this cause clay. You yeah, know, it does keep a bit of flexibility. You yeah, know, a, a normal um, polymer clay wouldn't do that. A, a polymer clay would be quite brittle. Whereas the cause clay it is rubber rubberized polymer kind of thing. You yeah, know, it's fantastic flexible plastic <laughs> is their logo, you yeah, know. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, it gives you that extra bit of security with your sculptures. You know, you know they're not that they can take a bit of a beating. <laughs> oh no, what's again that security when you're posting stuff out? Hi, that's a, a verbal contract, Stevie. That's a verbal contract. <laughs> He's all heard it. <laughs> Oh, and Blocker, do you know what's on the menu tonight for uh, for the, the gin? Tonight's gin night. So I'm always curious as to what, what, what he's drinking. <laughs> Not that I've ever tried gin. Well, you know, I tried it a while ago and didn't like it. So, But uh, Blocker always gets some nice flavour gins. That's it, Stevie. It's in chat. Once it's in chat, you can't take it out of chat.
Maybe he's one quiet. Maybe he's a way to grab his checkbook there. I don't know. I could be. I could be in for a payday here. <laughs> like Stevie could be boy. He could be a way to get his checkbook there. No, you called him out. You called him out on it, and he's all out. Oh, you're on. Oh ah. Jen, we're looking some juniper bars the other day. Oon thought, boy, if only I could distill this lovely flavor. <laughs> I've passed out, Mister. I know originals. Good evening, originals. If only I know. If only originals. Um, Celestia Seabird, personal social media online is counted as public quote. Thank you, thank you, Celestia Seabird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice one. Nice one. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> I'm not going to see any reason. Nice one. Nice one. I'm, and I'm awesome, Originals. I'm awesome, thanks. Yeah. It's been a good week so far. I'm excited about getting one of these Mad Balls finished, ready for moulding and casting. That's what I'm excited about, for sure. And nice, Originals. Glad you're enjoying the, the 80s tunes. Oh. Let's go! Flan Sorcery Sorcery! Good evening Flan Sorcery! Thank you for the follow! Much appreciated! Much appreciated! Hey, good to hear, love watching the sculpts always. Oh well, it's much appreciated. Much appreciated, Originals. Wild Country! What in the white material on- Oh, what's the white material, Wild Country? What I did was Wild Country. Uh, and- Good evening, by the way. Uh, rolled a tinfoil ball and then covered it in white masking tape. And then that means that, like a trade on this one, if if I do kind of want to abandon it, it'll easily peel off and none of the cosplay will be wasted. Yeah, I know. So that was, originally this was all covered like one of these ones, and I just tried peeling half of it. Just in case this doesn't go to plan, and I want to, you know, sculpt the front half first, and leave the back half completely, you know, you know clay free, as to what I've done here is, and just building up an extra layer on, on the front half that I'm going to sculpt on. You know, because I really have to stick to this rule of keeping these uh, spherical. You know, the newer designed ones don't stick to that rule as much. But no, stuff has to feel feel nice and comfortable in the hand. You know, it has to be tactile. You know. So yeah, wild country, that's just masking tape. Masking tape. And originals, you wish you could still sculpt? Seriously? You and you wouldn't you wouldn't give it a go? Or is it arthritis, is it? Arthritis. Uh, that's, I think you mentioned that before. Chronic pain, oh, having cramps in your hand, oh, flip sick, originals. Feel for you, like, feel for you. Not nice. Not in the state, no. No, definitely not. Definitely not. Stevie. <laughs> apologies, apologies. Yeah, oh, it was the pups. The pups are... I lit a candle. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh... There we go. Ooh. Ooh, that's a big that's a big flame. <laughs> that was burning green. Did anybody see that? That was burning green. <laughs> oh, it is very quiet, isn't it? Very quiet, sound alerts. Oh, I know why I turned it down because of text to speech. I was going to say, pull out my clay, not your claw. <laughs> <laughs> Feels better, Stevie. The spinach ought to be the spinach. <laughs> that would be the spinach. No, I, I'm not taking the rap for it. I'm telling you, that was me. If if it was me, I would tell you. That was me. That was either Ruby or Sam. More than likely Ruby. My bet. That's that. Yeah. That's right on brand for Ruby, like. You do too much. You have to rotate your mediums, bewitch. <laughs> oh, 
The dream is one day have your own room. All you don't have to do, you can just boom, 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 jatter around the room. <laughs> so we share the office with a partner because you like him. You gotta share the space. <laughs> Bewitch, I'm very lucky, very lucky to have my own room. Yep. Yeah, I talk about it a lot, how lucky I am. Yeah, I know. And believe me, I never forget it. I call it Medan. Medan. Uh, all our junk ends up in your partner space anyway. <laughs> I just, just, I just need moving this here for a wee minute. Aye, aye. Two days later. Aye, aye. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, this space is probably 70, 30. Okay. It's encroaching slowly. Uh. <laughs> no, I wouldn't mind. If Mel wanted to store some stuff in here, I wouldn't mind. As long as it's not my way or anything, or it's not in the, you know, it's not. <laughs> the Dean under your bed. Under your bed's called the, the, the Dean or the Dan. I the mic that across my eye. <laughs> Okay, there's two, two ready to go, half covered, hopefully this goes to plan. We clean the desk, I'm like ah, have a day later. <laughs> <laughs> How did that get there? That's your thing when you're working on a project. It's this space until you're done. Then do clean up. Then pull out the next medium. There's just too much, but I can't just do one thing. Studio pain, you can always finish your project to three. Oh, okay, originals, yeah. Turn through, but it's nice to have your iPad where you just grab it and you're done. No setup. Yeah, yeah. No chill stream. It's exactly what you need. Off the bed. Lovely. Originals. Will do. 99 originals. And originals, I can't remember. Do you stream? Can I give you a wee shout out before you go? I can't remember. Let me check. Yes, you sure do. And why am I not following? Oh, 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 sorry, sorry. Ads. Oh, oh, originals. Shame. I need a shame bell. I need a sh Yeah, I'll add that right now. Uh... Originals. Go. It'll probably be back, but you know. One of these. Good night. Oh, we'll do originals. G2, stay safe. Go. One of those. And drop a follow. Lovely. You guys did not see that, right? Refresh that because it's broke. Oh, right. No, sound alert. I need a shame, a shame bell sound alert, don't I? Yeah, I'm going to add it right now. Let's see. Let's see. How do I do that? <laughs> uh, some of that. Sound alerts. Yeah. We'll go. There it is. Add uh, that. And uh, how much will that have to be? Uh, say 500? 500. There we go. So now. There we go. Done. Does the text of speech reward work? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> so now when somebody jumps in and I'm not following and it should be, we can use that. That's good, Luna. Bug boy, are you working hard, dude? Are you?
Ah, uh, Bruce! What about you, Bruce? Good evening, dude. Hugs and hugs. Good to see you, man. Happy Wednesday. And Brooke? Good evening, Brooke. I'm sure Brooke's in the background there. Good evening, Brooke. Let's see. I'll turn this music down. Could Bruce would be shared out. It's probably broke black, but, you know, still gotta do it. Nice one. Nice one. Hope you're good, man. Oh, yeah. Got a wee taste. Oh, waste. Nah, that's no good. That's no good. Let's see what we'll, what we'll get through a brook shout out. I think we got that right, Brooke Odyssey. Ah, dude, I do, you know. Going always going around breaking shit, aren't you? Ah, <laughs> uh, just always going around right there. Bruce, that's like why you can't have nice things. On, like, Look, there's perfect. There's Brooks Brooks shout outs playing perfectly. Oh, um, right. yeah, yeah. All right. Hurry. You forgot. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> perfectly. Brooke shared it. Worked perfectly. As always, Brooke. Nice work. Nice work. <laughs> oh, no, Bruce. Sort it out, dude. Sort it out. <laughs> And remember, if you're not following Bruce, <laughs> love it. <laughs> oh, the wait oh, before giving another shout out. Seriously, you bollocks. What was that? Seriously? Ah, oh, nice one. Nice one, Israel. So 31 out of 40 a-holes. A-hole. <laughs> and somehow I've not made one. Rose, don't speak too soon, Rose. Don't speak too soon. So I have to wait 58 minutes, 55 seconds before giving a shout out. Are you joking the chat? Oh, 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 no, never mind. You were counting? Okay, oh, nice one, Ezra. Nice one. <laughs> nice one, dude. Right, let's see about getting these divided up again. Get my reference lines on. I know, Ezra, you already did, dude. I know, dude. How did I ever doubt you? How did I ever doubt you? I oh, know. Yeah, I know he did. I know he did. I know. Oh, music, music. Ding, 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 shame, ding, ding, ding. Fucking pro boy. I know Ezra, and modest too. <laughs> oh, you walk in that one though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. That was a good one. Yeah, I'm proud of myself for that one. <laughs> Nailed it. Pro streamer. <laughs> that is fan sip on the beverage. <laughs> I refund it again, dude. Refund it again. Right. Center line. Hmm, Ezram. Yeah, where would you be indeed? Where would you be? Yeah. 
Where did you have it last? Where did you? Yeah, I know. Although if you knew we had it last, you'd go back there and get it, wouldn't you? <laughs> Behind your ear, Mickey, of course. Of course. One is still weird. That's the first. <laughs> Bad brain. <laughs> Keeping you on your toes, Esrom. Keeping you on your toes. Lovely. All right. Do you need a squirt? Is that why you're up on about? Mm hmm. Right, Spike. You're in charge. Were you going to say something there? Does it look like you're going to say something there? Hmm? What up? What's up? Oh, excuse me. What's up with you? Did you write? Hmm? Tell me. What? What is it? Oh. 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 Itsy bum. Well, I'm not scratching that. No chance. Uh, Celestial, I spent a good minute this morning standing in the hallway trying to decide why you were there, Celestial. <laughs> Celestial, you're safe for just going on, getting about, go on, on about your day, and it'll, you know it'll come back to you eventually. Genie, were you going to sit up nice there, were you? Oh wow! Oh, you're so athletic, so athletic, on oh, a big stretch. Wow. What about you, Sam? We all right? Hmm. We'll go outside for a pee. And Brock says hello, by the way. We'd like a treat. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. Yep. Two puppers. <laughs> oh, God. Are we wheelie without the wheelies? Yeah, yeah. Are we wheelie without the wheels, even? Aye, aye. Or Brock, are we say it's like she's doing thriller, you know the thriller dance? That's what we say. Mm, you gonna do it once more, Ruby? Hey, he leave his bottle home. You gonna set up nice and showman? Wow. Wow, so athletic. Yep. Oh, you get one too, and you, you you deserve it. Yeah, there you go. You get it, okay. Right, yeah. Well. So clever. Mm -hmm. Are you going to sit? Are you going to lay down? No, no, lay down. You, no, don't give a lip. Are you going to lay down? Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's better. You know, you can lay down. She's going to get lippy. I can't do this like a human. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, you going to sit? Oh, wow. Uh, 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 all right. What? What is it? What's wrong? Do you need a pee? Hmm? Do you need outside for a pee? Yeah? Is that what's wrong? Okay. We'll go. We'll all go. All right. All right. All right. We'll all go for a pee. Yeah. Well, uh, we're going now. All right. Oh, no. Oh, see? It's close to midnight. You know, if I put Thriller on, it makes more sense. But, you know, th think of it if Thriller was playing and she did that. <laughs> All right? Eh? Like Michael Jackson, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good boy, Sam. Good boy. Oh, thank you, boy. It's... Thank you. Right, I'll be back. I'll be back. We'll, we'll all go outside for a pee. So we will. All right, back. <laughs> did I miss anything? Oh, Salador Mythica. What about you, Salador? Good evening. Good evening. What's the track for yourself? Oh. Alrighty. So now, got these balls the way I want them. And, and thanks very much, Salador. Yeah, appreciate it. Appreciate it. I've been working hard on these balls. <laughs> good evening. Good evening. Yeah, it's all good. All good here. Yeah, been a nice, nice night so far. Productive. 
Yeah. So now, because this is cosplay and not monster play, I can smoosh. So what I'll do is get this reference up. And then I'll use my thumbs just to smoosh in where the eyes are. Oh no, what I should really do first is roughly mark where the nose is, just roughly. Which is just below the center line. Good bit. There. Oh, me too. Yeah, remember the race time with detachable bodies? Yeah, they sure did. They sure did. Yeah, uh, I didn't have one of those, Ed, one of the original ones. But yeah, it's certainly one of my favorite toys. Oh, Salador, you haven't seen any of the Japanese advertising for them when they were out in the 80s? 86, I think it was? That's, what do you see some of this? Where do you see this? You and my boss comic? Seriously? That's brilliant. And you've got some of the tattoo bodies, dude? Yeah, you keep saying, man, I need to see pictures of them. I need to see pictures of them. Even just for reference. Well, look at that, isn't that mad? Isn't that mad? Look at this. We weren't getting that sort of artwork on ours. Isn't that lovely, Dick? Look at that. That's crazy. I know. Like a horror poster? Yeah. Yeah. So we got. Oh, no, no, that's not it. But yeah, yeah. For Beetlejuice, we'll do. What? What? Idiot. That's a bit more familiar. Hmm. Well, well. Aye, it's crazy, you mad looking? A bit of a toy commercial day this week, I saw a bunch of Mad Santas and Dr. Dreadful commercials, nice. Nice, funny, I watched a wee mini documentary by Slimehouse on YouTube, on on the, the history of my boss. Oh no. no. Let me see. I'll try to find it earlier, but uh, if you search uh, see a Slimehouse, Let's see. Yeah, my boss. There we go. There is a link for it there. And yeah, there was a cartoon. I don't remember anything about it either. No, I certainly don't remember anything about it. I wouldn't lie and say that I do because I don't like. But yeah, this guy, whole wee mini documentary, 25 minutes. You know, really good turnaround shots of all of them. If you if you want any inspiration, like, yeah, worth 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 watching. Twenty five minutes, like, same house. Oh, and if you do watch it, feel free to leave a comment to let them know who sent you. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Mother's brick. What about Brooke? Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday to you, Brooke. Hope you're well. Hope you're well. Right, so yeah, just use my thumbs. Just to start marking out the eyes. 
uh, Toy Galaxy Secret Galaxy with this channel is new. Yeah, it was new to me too. It was new to me too. Salador, yeah. Yeah. Slime House. Got a really a good collection video, sir. Like. So I'm just slowly pushing it, kind of pushing it outward because I want the, you know, the the kind of clay to bunch up on the on the on the outside edge. Got a bit of a dent there where the nose is. Listen along with Bruce, but it was uploading them. Oh, emotes. Oh, nice one, Bruce. Or oh, Bruce, nice one, Brooke. <laughs> you were listening with Bruce. Nice one. New emotes. Can you show them off, Brooke? Can you show them off? If you made your mob ball, it would be like a beholder or a Kodamon. A like a beholder, you say? <laughs> and yeah, Brooke, I'm awesome, thanks. I'm I'm buzzing, yeah. I, I'm, uh, I'm all about the mod balls at the minute. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Eh. Uh, if, I mean, if you've followed me for any length of time, I, I, I end up talking about them uh, one way or another, you know. Ezrom, never dude. No, I ain't painting that. Can you imagine painting that? That'll be a bollocks. <laughs> Can you imagine painting that? <laughs> no chance. No chance. What a nightmare. What a freaking nightmare. Ah, oh, yes, Brooke. Nice, Brooke. Ezrom, the most I'll maybe do is buy like a tin of nice coloured spray paint. Do you know what I mean? Just a tin, and just hit him with a tin of spray paint. I think it'd be the best, wouldn't it? And trying to keep it symmetrical. Yeah, this is what I love about the squishiness of cosplay. Yeah, I know. This is what monster clay was lacking when it, you know when it was sculpting with the monster clay. You were relying way more on your carving skills. Oh, I know the one. Yeah, yeah. See, just when you say that, Salador, and that guy Slimehouse has has made his own toy version of the Kako Demon. Yeah, the Kako Kako Demon. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, it's a uh, uh, cosplay. Cosplay. Oh no. The Astral Dreadnought. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so think of this like a uh, Sculpey, except uh, it's rubberized, like rubberized Sculpey. Yeah, yeah. That's bugger, bugger, dude. <laughs> Oh, Ruby needs her bed fixed. Seriously, squirt. No, leave Sam alone. He's comfy. And you haven't even had a gin yet? <laughs> <laughs> right, Sam. We'll touch your... Oh, here. No, you come over here. Sorry, come over here. There you go. You jump in there. Ruby, leave you alone. You want yours fixed? There you go. There we go. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I suppose you paint that beholder a bit impressionistly, like it's coming out of the shadows. Of, yeah, so when you had to put details on the bits closest, like it's emerging in the torchlight. Yeah, or or just a xenothal. Do you know what I mean? Just a simple xenothal. Yeah, and then paint the eye. Yeah, no. I'll see. I'll see. I'm, I'm no, like I say, I'm in no rush. It was made for for me anyway. Yeah, no, it's not like it was commission. I'll probably not go too far with these tonight. I probably will just get them to this sort of point and uh, and then leave it there. Continue on on Friday. Yeah, I know. Oh, New York, we watch. Yeah, 
Yeah, I know, Mr. Hans. Some munchies, nice. Oh yeah, great tune, great tune. Odd video as well, that one. M. Salad, yeah, yeah. The the best way to explain it is to see if. Seriously, you two. Seriously. Yeah, M. What I've done is put that layer on there, and that means I can I can uh, sculpt the detail into this and and bake it. And that means when I'm adding the the clay on the back, you know, it'll keep that that spherical sort of shape. I need to keep that spherical outline. I can't sort of deviate from that too much. But yeah, I'll just bake it, bake it when it's ready to go, and or bake it at a point where I think it can save my work, sort of thing. Ruby's being very restless tonight, aren't you, Squirt? Oh, Dragon Skullin! I'm glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear it, because so did I. So did I, and they were awesome, weren't they? Weren't they awesome? And good to see you in Dragon Skullin. Good evening. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is the one I'm trying to do in my own style at the minute. This is the guy. Can't remember what his name is. Or Boneface? I don't know. <laughs> but, yeah. And what's crack for yourself? Good evening, good evening. What? What are we doing? I'm skipping this, sorry, I'm skipping this. Sorry, apologies if if you're enjoying that, but that's more like it. Dave, Dave. You know. <laughs> yeah, that's better, isn't it? Isn't that better? Killers. Come on. Come on. Uh, Bewitz, uh, killers? <clears throat> killers. Are we human or are we dancer? Nobody really knows. That's the, you know... That's, that's the point. <laughs> Yeah, killers. Fur, yeah. It's not exactly 80s either. I don't know what somebody did put them in an 80s playlist. Don't know who's responsible for that. Because uh, it's not my playlist. It's just one I randomly found on YouTube. Just 80s. And we've got 10 to 10. Let's see. Are you okay? Flip sick. Ruby's sitting over here in the corner like a like a lost child. Hmm. Oh, well, they work. Look at her wee leg going. <laughs> oh, squirt. Not wild rose. She's trying to get him out of his bed now. I know that's exactly what she's doing. Celestial, I know. 
<laughs> She's trying to get him out of his bed. Monster Clay in the crackpot was hardened good luck. You don't need it though, Hadden. You'll be fine, honestly. You'll be fine. What you'll notice is, Hadden, right? It'll start melting around the edges first. Do you know what I mean? So when it starts melting around the edges, you can sort of get it moving, you know, and get it stirred up and it'll melt all the quicker. Yeah, I know. But no, you'll be fine. Just shaping, getting that, those cheekbones in. But yeah, Hadden, I know exactly how you feel. You know what I mean? New material, new material, nervous. But give it five minutes and it'll be totally fine. Once you get it going, you'll be like, oh, flip me. I don't even know what I was worried about. So you will. Oh, pill time, Mr. Dan. This one, get it into you. Ready, there we go. I think that's a great start. Great start. Um uh, Salador I don't think so. The the uh, no, the uh, they did the garbage, you know, the garbage peel kids. They did they did a mix with those, a license with those, but that's it, that's it. Yeah, uh -huh. that's about it. it was it, although I do remember seeing like an alien. An alien mod ball and a Freddy Krueger mod ball and hmm, I don't know if they were official or not though. Yeah, but yes, there's ten o'clock. I'll leave it there tonight, pick it up early as I can on Friday, and we'll get a good sort of four, four to five hour stream Friday. But that's where I'm leaving these for tonight. I've got sort of basic form, keeping it in the round as much as I can. I want to keep that sort of kidney shaped eye socket, if you look what you see. Or it's a bit like a sort of heart on its side. See so this sort of shape. I want to keep that sort of shape. That shape's very familiar. You know, familiar to that design. But yeah, very happy. Very happy. Good start. I think that's going to work out well, the fact that I haven't added any clay on the back yet. Yeah, I know. I don't need to worry. If, you know, just focus on the on the front first. Get that front away like it. Get it baked. And then that means all of this, I can add a layer of clay on. And it'll stay that round shape kind of thing. Here's hoping anyway. But yeah, thanking you for chilling out tonight. Been a productive stream. It's good to get back. DJ Coke? What about you, DJ Coke? Good evening. Thank you for the follow and welcome in. Come on on in, come on on in. I'm just getting ready to re uh, to, to read out. And yeah, we're back on Friday. But let's see first who are we going to read. Look at this. Look, look, what's... What's the crack with this, hmm? 
from Greece. Oh, DJ Cook from Greece. What about you, DJ Cook? And DJ, uh, do you stream yourself? Let's see. Let's get a wee nosy. Oh, yeah, certainly. Oh, nice one. Nice one. Let's see. Turn the music down. Let's see what DJ Cook gets up to. Oh, Broken 77. What about Broken 77? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, oh. oh, oh, it's broke. What well, do you know? Sorry about that, DJ Cook. Sorry. They, they don't work very well. Right. Oh, no. Yeah. There you go, Rose. We spin there before you go. But yeah, welcome in. Welcome in. Let's see, give you one of these. Uh, drop we follow there we go and broken I'm awesome thanks yeah I'm awesome about to read out here and grab a wee bit of supper celestial bird 98 98 celestial bird oh crafting space for sure for sure crafting space did you get a shout out crafting space did you I know they don't really work out well, but think of it like a wee snapshot. Uh, I would say... You know, a wee snapshot of what you get up to. Uh, completed within the last... Oh, oh, oh that's, that's that one. I back into an amazing song, bro. I know, I know. Good one to finish on, isn't it? That's a good one to finish on. Oh, still haven't decided who we're going to raid yet. Is anybody any raid suggestions? I don't mind raiding a new channel if I haven't raided before, like. Well, here, Cracker Night, very productive, just how I like it. See, it's Friday. Friday, yeah. We'll get some more done. And please do, if you have any pictures of mod balls, please do get them on the Discord. Really, asking people to post pictures of their balls on Discord. Please do, please do. <laughs> Blocker, big love, dude. Big love. Brooke, big love, Brooke. Hugs and nugs. Blocker, well do, man. Well do. Of course, of course. Start that. Big love everyone. Lurkers, thank you lurkers. Laney, Laney, don't be working too hard, Laney. I shall see you Friday. <laughs> love you too, King Dixon. <laughs> 99, must stay on. 99, must stay on. 99, see you later. Yeah, supper time. Supper time. Eh, poppers? What is fancy? Cheese and toast? Well, the cheese and toast it is. See you later, bye! Thank you!